welcome everyone so yes a lot of people thought that the answer for this one is supposed to be 25 now let's quickly understand why they thought that is see they're saying a salary is 25 percent more than b then b's salary will be how much less than a it's very obvious like a lot of people think that this has to be 25 now this is wrong now let me just quickly explain you why when you have something like this i tell my students that you assume one of the salary to be 100 so let's take b's salary to be 100 because that becomes easier for us so what is a salary that is what 100 that is b salary plus 25 percent of b salary right so when i took 100 now if you see things are becoming very easy these are cancelling so a salary came out very easily we got it as 125 now we need to see how much is b salary less than a so what we will do is b minus a upon comparison is with a multiplied by 100 so what we will do is b salary which is 100 and 125 sorry we'll do because a is higher so we'll do a minus b okay so a minus b so 125 minus 100 that gets you what 25 upon 125 which is a salary into 100 now this happens is what ones are and fives are this is ones are and 20s are so therefore answer for this question is supposed to be 20 percent so you saw that not necessarily every time what looks so easy is actually the answer. Okay, and a lot of people made a very silly mistake in these kind of questions. So whenever you think that the answer is quite obvious, just cross verify with these kind of methods. It's easier to do this. It doesn't even take more than one minute. So I hope this is very, very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.